probably can't see shit. It's like five in the morning, nice and cold. We've got a jumper, so that's nice. I'm just out here with William because Jason's a little bitch. He's too tired. He was out partying because he's a fucking animal, apparently. To be honest, I'm regretting this. I'll probably meet you down there on the rocks or some shit or once that sun actually comes up because I can't really see anything and I've rolled my ankle three times already. Moon looks cool though. Ah, we're going for the first cast of the morning. Because it's the fucking morning, not night time. Can't tell when I'm on the bottom because I can't see my line. I'm just gonna check if that wind dies off. Yeah, it does. It's just dead easily right now. So you want a bit of northerly wind? Because it's dark, I might as well explain what we're doing. Just uh, have a, a very legal spot to fish. Doing a bit of micro jigging. Hooked some uh, big fish previously. We just like the appeal it has over big and small fish. It's just a variety. Other than that, there's not really too much else information. Oh, this morning deserves a cracker juice. Get some. I live and breathe these things. Probably why I want to die at a very young age. Nice weather we're having. I'm so cold. Very cold easterly winds to my left. Blowing in the cold morning means I've got hard nipples. We are currently running with the, or my favorite flicky setup, Twin Power 2500, with the new rod I actually haven't used until today, it's an NS Black Hole Sprite. Very nice rod. Quite expensive for a China rod, but she does the job. Solid tip with titanium guide. Doesn't have guides, just a titanium tip guide, I believe. It's kind of a scam, but oh well. No idea what I was going on about. It's probably just a big grass. Oh my god. There you go. What the f that, I think it's a big skippy. Oh, he's aggressive. Oh, don't do that, don't do that, don't do that, don't do that. I can go a little bit harder on him. Oh, it's a pinky. <gasps> Don't do that! <laughs> no, no, please! Nah, it's all good. Oh, popped him. There he is. And quick release, because I'm a fucking idiot. Doesn't count. Didn't touch the leader. I was so mad. <laughs> that was a good fight. Damn it. That was pinky number one last. Just legit cast to the left, because it works right in front of you with the wind. But yeah, I didn't even feel it. I just went to work the jig, and then he hit it. I feel like a kook talking to myself, but it needs to be done. Yeah. Why did I try? Again? Nah, it's a herring. 100%. Wow. <laughs> oh, what is this? Oh, it's, it's a pinky. <laughs> they, they fight so good, man. <laughs> Am I ready? <laughs> Oh, you fucking you bastard. Right, I'm gonna let him run out. Oh, he's running. Oh, he is in the reef. I've only got 10 pound leader. <laughs> oh, I'm reef reef. Wow. Oh, you fucking annoying fish. <laughs> Get out, please, man. I don't want to tie another FG. Looks <sighs> like I'm tying another knot. anymore. FG tie, fish lost. Since we lost that fish in some very unfortunate events, we we'll just finished tying a, the FG knot. It's quite windy, so that was very annoying. I lost a very expensive jig, so I'm not happy. There we go. That's ready for some action. We're ready. I should have said quiet. You heard me? Oh, that 12 pound leader and the guide. <laughs> if I hook up this drop, it will be the jig then. 
it might even be the assist hook, like a bit of attraction. Probably the most far fetched thing I've ever said in my life, but I mean, we've got Jason's in there. So you can, oh, I'm getting nibs. Nearly dropped my fucking drink. Must be losing my mind. Bastard bitch. Oh, I'm not letting you smoke me. Oh, what is that? It's a fucking grass. Fuck off. That's disgusting. I knew I shouldn't have worked it close to the rocks. These are such a pain to get off. When there's pinkies and shit around, I don't want to be catching one of these. Nice and cold. So sad, man. I'm so sad. Go away, go away, get off of my jig, go away, go away, stinky thing. Man. Oh, he went away. Oh, this wind is nice and warm. Oh, go away, herring. I don't want you, man. Please, leave my jig alone. I don't want you, dude. Oh, something's chasing it. What the fuck is that? Behind it. Oh, it's a big tailor. Holy shit, do you see it? That was sick. Oh, come here. I don't want to high stick my ride. Come here. Oh, I nearly got a cop a jig in the hand. You could have all the hooks in the world, but a herring just won't stay on. Oh, oh that was a pretty decent hit. No. Oh. I reckon. Oh, yeah, he's aggressive. Oh yeah, that's a hundred million percent of Taylor. I want to go a bit light on him, mate. I don't want to pull hooks. I thought my phone, I thought the knob was going to fall off the send. What are you crazy, dude? Oh, there's another Taylor with him. Alright. Give up, dude. Give up. I'm the micro. No, not really. It must just be the Easterlies. Surprise, surprise. There we go. That's actually a decent chopper. Took a liking to the micro. Right, we're gonna get na nice and nasty close. Oh, he just threw up all this bait. That's foul. That's foul. Get in your mouth. Nasty little creature. The Taylor went for KFC, dog. God, it's so cold. <laughs> nah, it's all good. That's 
a herring. That's a herring. That's a herring. All right. I'm not one to complain about some fishing action, but when there's so many other better fish around, oh, I've got two on one. I literally have two herring on one jig right now. Oh no, one came off. That would have been awesome. I hate touching these things. Oh, especially the baby ones. They're so spiky. Nice little smallmouth bass. Nice little smallie. We better release him. <laughs> he definitely owns the record for most backflips. Come on, guys. Get on the micro jigs, man. They catch everything. Yeah, I was going to say, I think it's time for some sunnies. It's a bit sunny. Do you get it? It's been quite a cold but eventful morning. William's going around the corner, probably for fuck all. Of course, that small window of opportunity in the morning, once that sun just rises, he uh, hooked one and lost it. It's fucking around tying some knots and now it's, it's pretty quiet. There's not much else that can happen at this point, but you, know, you never know, you can get lucky. Just had to do a quick GoPro battery changeover. Hopefully, we can get stuck into some more fish. I'll take anything at this point. It's really fun. All right, we're back on the chest mount. So we're still going with the micro jigs. I said to uh, to William before that I might want to change to a plastic later on, but these jigs are just too much fun. It has a horrible cast. Yeah, so what we're doing is just essentially just bouncing along the bottom. And most of the time you'll get the fish hitting them on the actual drop. You do have to work them quite high up and then let them sink right down. To be honest, I just like to do this little erratic action. You do get them quite high up and they just flood them on the drop. That's when you get most of your hits. Main species goal is probably just pinkies, like little ones, because they fight very, very nice and there's light stuff. Well, that's just the thing with micro jigs. You practically get anything that swims in the water on these things. That's why we love them so much. You do get a lot of small fish though. efficient way of landing fish. <laughs> My drag was a bit too tight for this poor little thing. But again, these things definitely, definitely fight quite hard. There we go. Nice little skipjack. Oh, the jig's really got him there. Oh, don't do that. Oh, I hooked him in the eye. All right, you guys don't have to watch this part. All right. Say goodbye to old skipjack. Don't know what's going on with his eye. It was pretty messed up, but I reckon it'll be fine. There's plenty of those guys around. I did hook him quite close to the rocks anyway. That is definitely a herring without a doubt. Oh, the jig just came launching at me. So there is plenty of those guys around, but again, if you're not after him, they're quite annoying. If you are, well, there you go. Get yourself some micro jigs to target them. Uh, all I know is they absolutely froth on the micro jigs. If they're in a feeding mood. Honestly, herring will quit pretty much anything that small. Another one, 100%. Ah, I've got to stop working it too high. Right, you dropped it. Might be a skippy, that feels a bit... Oh no, it's a herring. Yes, let go. Hate mucking around with those guys, they're frustrating as all hell. Oh, that feels good. That feels better. Head shakes, it's, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking pinky. No, I had one before. This is much more aggressive. I could be wrong, but I'm not, I'm not going easy on him, to be honest. After what happened. Okay, 
it's a, it's a pinky. Will this be the first landed one? Oh, you bastard. That was quick. Jesus. <laughs> um, oh, he's hooked bloody amazingly. First pink of the session. There you go. Nice little pinky. There's the jig. Doing its job. Hook, unhook that quite easily, as we learned before. That's all it takes, and we'll release him. Oh, that screams herring. That screams pulled that hooks. No, it didn't. Really? Did it feel heavy? Yeah. Fuck. For the Shimano team deal we had in April ages ago. Oh my god. Oh, no. oh that's fucking huge, man. What is that? Is that a. What the fuck is that? It's a. No, no. My heart's broken. Oh, it is. Oh, it's a sandbow. It's right there. Fucking Sambo! Fuck! <laughs> that was sick. No, I haven't caught. I've seen them, but that's it. Oh, that was awesome! Well, that's three palms jigs lost. Legit, as soon as I snapped off, I seen him come out in the cruise. See, these are the days that make me not want to go to work. I just want to stay here. All right, so we've changed it up. We've got a little uh, squid plastic on there. One of the Nedlock jig heads. We're just rubbing some beautiful scent in. Might even give it a little lick. All right, let's see if we can't pull, pull something. Hopefully not pull hooks or snap off. Right. Let's have a look at this. Oh my shit cast. I did not expect that. Me. I keep letting go too early. I'll just let it sink there and see what happens. I'm just gonna have a constant bow in mind. <laughs> Herring. It is. I oh, know. Oh no. That's a pinky. Oh no. Oh. Technically first cut. No, it's a pinky. Come up. Oh, he inhaled that man. That's a good one. Holy shit. He's a solid one. They froth on these plastics. I know, I bet you there's some bigger ones out there. All right, well, that was an eventful morning. I pretty much got to get changed and go to work straight away. Honestly, that was a really good session. Very unfortunate that I lost that very large fish, which I can, without a doubt, 100% identify that it was a Sambo, because the second it busted me off on the rocks, I actually seen it swim out. You can't really pick it up on the GoPro, as far-fetched as that sounds, but, you know, when you're fishing eight pound with 12 pound litre, that sort of stuff happens. But these videos, well, this one in particular is just another experiment with, I don't really know how I exactly want these videos to turn out and just the actual layout themselves. So they might differ from each other till I find a really comfortable and easy way to actually edit them and also film because filming and gathering the actual footage, actually editing it and putting it together is the real hard part, especially making it enjoyable with all like little cutscenes and whatnot and the chatting parts. And it just becomes really hard to fish in between. As long as I get some sort of footage out there, I'm not too fussed. But we'll see how this video turns out if I do end up getting off my ass and actually editing it. But I really think I should because I caught a fair few decent fish. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll guess I'll see you in the next video if I continue to make these because they're quite fun. So uh, I'll see you later.